in today's session we're going to be talking about TLS 1.3 okay in the previous session we discussed 1.2 and here we're going to be talking about 1.3 and in specifically looking at what is the difference between version 1.2 and 1.3 so first of all 1.3 is more secure and I'll explain that in a minute right so basically what we're going to do is we're going to start off you know with our goal here which is to establish that secure channel right so first of all what I happen similar to TLS 1.2 right the client is going to send out the hello packet okay so nothing changes there but however what does change here is that remember in version 1.2 the client was giving a suite of cipher suites that it was supporting right in this instance we don't do that there are no options in TLS 1.3 right so that's the most important thing right is actually always comes with Gephi helmets right which you which um, which actually has you know it's not giving any choices on the key exchange and basically in addition to the hello we now do also the key exchange okay so that happens in the first uh, set of communication, the first packet, right? So then what actually happens, okay, is the web server is going to send back the key share. Okay, so we put that, the key exchange. Okay, and it's also going to give the cert, the SSL cert. And then finally, it's just going to say finish. So you see basically in this session here, if you look at it, in a single round trip, we, the client gave the hello and the key exchange and the web server gave the, uh, the server hello plus the key exchange and finally the SSL cert and finished, right? That all happened in a single round trip. And thereafter, basically what happens is the symmetric session key is established, which is used for the communication back and forth, right? So basically in TLS 1.2, we saw two sets of round trips here, right? We saw a round trip there of the hello. We had the two hellos, the hello from the client and the server. And then we saw two uh, finished packets, one from the client and one from the server, right? So we went basically from two round trips to a single round trip. And that is basically version 1.3, right? So Really, in version 1.3, if you look at it, we did a maximum of, you know, in this instance, we did a maximum of uh, 0 to 3 packets. And in the TLS 1.2, there is usually about 5 to 7 packets. So we put that into 5 to 7 packets in there. Okay. Now, a couple of other things that we want to kind of like bear in mind here is that with TLS 1.3, right? Now, now that we established that there are no options, we're not giving any options of selecting this stuff, right? Um, even we're not giving the selection of actually choosing what TLS version that we're using. There is you no, know, there is a static, there is no static RSA handshakes, it's, it's a full handshake uh, with signature. You know, there's downgrade protection in version 1.3. Uh, it's deprecating some of the weaker ciphers, right? So uh, things like SHA-1, MD5, things like that. Um, there's no renegotiation, uh, things like that. You know, all the weaker stuff has actually been removed, right? And that's what makes version 1.3 more secure, right? Because it's using more secure protocols, it's not providing any options, and also, if you look in terms of kind of like the performance here, because we're using just round two round, a single round trip here, right? Which will basically mean like each time we have it. So let's say, for example, we had, we start off at zero milliseconds here, okay? And we send the first packet and it actually it sends the first packet and it comes at 50 milliseconds in terms of like the speed, the latency that we have. When it comes back here, the, the second packet over here, we're getting it down to 100 milliseconds, okay? So, and then if you, you know, we down, brought it down to 100. So essentially, if you think about it, we were, when, when we were at this stage, when the packet came back over here, we were at 200 milliseconds, because remember, we have to now do uh, four exchanges back and forth. On the TLS 1.2, we were at 200 milliseconds. So now you can see now we've increased the performance um, half fold, right? So we improved the performance there. So if you think about it here, it's more version 1.3 is more efficient, it's more secure, um, but the reality is only 80% of the world's 
TLS traffic right now is version 1.2. Okay, just to keep that in mind. Okay, thank you.